So we've just extended our little game from section 2 to add a couple of sound effects. If we click on the diamond we get a boing and if we click on a flower we get a, a gliss effect. So we'll just look at the code for that. We've got an audio context which is essential for any sound. We've got two sound effects going in. A correct sound effect that uses the gliss source that you can find here and here and a wrong sound effect which uses the boing source and we simply add into our tap event this if the sprite index is 4 then the uh, index being chosen is that one the one at 1 1 is that which is index number 4 0 1 2 3 4 so if the sprite index has been hit with the mouse has an index value of 4 then we play the wrong sound effect and if not and the hit test has been effective then we play the correct sound effect very easy but adds a lot to the game this video is from my Udemy course HTML5 Game Development Beginner to Pro. To get the full course at a great discount, pull down the description.